Okay, now we're ready for the last part of our discussion of Freddie Mac's and Fannie Mae's risk management strategy. By the way, don't feel like I've covered everything here. There are a lot of details about, um, especially about how the underwriting standards are met and so on. I mean, if, if the, the written seller, ser seller guides uh, went on for dozens and dozens of pages. Uh, you know, how an appraisal gets done. Um, just all, all, there's just an incredible amount of effort involved in kind of standardizing these procedures. And I, I'm just I'm being very brief and very terse in describing this. I'm only describing it at kind of a high general level. Uh, so the things I want to talk about today are servicer management and loss mitigation. So the servicer is the uh, after the loan is sold. A servicer is the agent that processes the payments for Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae. So you have the borrower making payments, and they go to the servicer, it passes them through to Freddie Mac or Fannie Mae, let's say Freddie, and then they, Freddie then pays those payments out to security holders. Okay, so there's this whole process of money going uh, through here and uh, so what Freddie and Fannie want the servicer to do are um, you know things like uh, make sure that the payments are accurate uh, they want to uh, make sure that things like that uh, insurance gets paid Right, the, because the borrower's borrower's payment includes payment for uh, homeowners insurance typically, um, and they want to make sure that taxes get paid, and because uh, the borrower's payments includes taxes and so on. Um, and finally, when the uh, if the borrower doesn't make their payment on time, then the uh, Freddie Mac or Fannie Mae want the servicer to, uh, you know, contact the borrower and take the uh, the steps that Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae put in their manual to try to bring the the borrower back into a position of, of paying and making current payments. Uh, so, in, <coughs> uh, so these are the so the the servicer is is acting you know, as an agent of Freddie Mac or Fannie Mae. What the servicer gets is what's called a servicing fee. Uh, it might be, uh, let's say, 15 basis points. So if the borrower makes a, uh, you know, let's say has an interest rate of 4.50%, the servicer will will have to pass through only 4.35 percent and they can retain they retain the other 15 basis points uh, <coughs> as a fee to uh, compensate them for the cost of the servicing uh, <coughs> so um, so what servicer management involves is giving precise instructions to servicers about what's expected um, so there's known as the servicer guide or the servicer manual which is that tells servicers exactly what they're what's uh, required of them um, then pay the fee is their incentive for uh, for carrying out those instructions and then Pulling servicing, that is taking the servicing away from a, a, from a, one servicer and transferring it to another, uh, is kind of the stick that Freddie Mac or Fannie Mae hold over a servicer. So if a ser if the servicer uh, does a poor job of following the instructions, Freddie Mac or Fannie Mae can do what's called pulling servicing. They can take the um, 
take the entire batch of loans, which might be you know thousands of loans from the servicer, and say, no, we're we're going to give those uh, the servicing responsibilities to somebody else who can be do a better job of following our instructions. So that's the ultimate stick that uh, that Freddie Mac and Fannie may have. <coughs> a, a major function of the servicer acting as Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae's agent is this issue of loss mitigation. Can you, once a borrower is late in their payments, can you do uh, a good job of either getting the borrower current or quickly reaching a settlement, going to foreclosure or a short sale or what have you? Um, so there's this whole category of loss mitigation, and again, there's a whole set of instructions about what Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae want servicers to do in cases where borrowers aren't making their payments current and uh, there will be <coughs> some so Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae's uh, servicer management departments will be keeping an eye on servicers and seeing which servicers might be uh, failing to follow through on their obligations to follow instructions to uh, minimize losses. So this is another uh, business practice that you probably wouldn't think a whole lot about if you were just uh, sitting uh, in an academic office designing a, uh, a housing finance system, but this is actually an important expensive business process, a process that requires a lot of detail work, which I'm not really get, getting into here, uh, in order to execute properly, uh, in order to uh, make sure that servicing is done properly. So I'll just leave it at that.